A Boston woman critically injured when she jumped out of an Uber and into rush hour traffic inside the O'Neill Tunnel. And tonight, an exclusive interview with that Uber driver. Good evening, I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. She says her passenger seemed distraught getting into her car at the airport. Julie McDonald joins us now. And Julie, this driver has lost her job. Well, Lisa and David, her accounts with Uber and Lyft have been frozen while police investigate. The passenger, though, didn't have the Uber app. According to this driver, she knocked on her window at Logan and seemed desperate about getting home. <laughs> Luce Ayala breaks down crying as she relives the nightmare. Monday morning, giving a ride to a stranger. She heard her backseat door open and that passenger was gone. She said, I feel traumatized. I've never gone through something like that. I've never been in trouble. After falling to the ground in the O'Neill Tunnel during rush hour, that passenger was hit by another car. Me quedé en shock. Ayala remembers, I was in shock. I didn't understand what was going on. Then I saw her behind my car. This bizarre ride started at Logan Airport. Ayala had just completed an Uber drop-off and heard a knock on her window. The 29-year-old woman seemed worried. She didn't have the Uber app and she needed a ride home to Mattapan. The driver said, I have been there, desperate, in places where I didn't know what to do and nobody helps you. So she turned off the app and started toward Mattapan. But after a few minutes, she said that passenger thought they were going the wrong way. She jumped out and was struck. Me siento mal, super mal porque... The driver said, I feel really bad. I always like to be helpful. I have it inside me to help people. I've always been like that. Ayala said that she's a safe, responsible driver, but she can't drive for Uber or Lyft while police investigate. She's worried about paying her bills, and she's very worried for the passenger in the hospital. Saying she suffers from something because a normal person wouldn't do this. That woman was rushed to Tufts Medical Center in critical condition. The driver who hit her did stay at the scene, and there have been no charges against him. David? All right, Julie, thank you.